Five Nights at Freddy's is the long-anticipated adaptation of the series of horror games from the genius mind of Scott Cawthon. Hunger Games star, Josh Hutcherson takes on the lead role of troubled security guard, Mike, who is forced to take a job at a closed-down diner called Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. He soon discovers some creepy old animatronics scattered around the rundown venue, and trouble ensues. Blumhouse are behind the production of this movie, so expectations were very high based on their track record, but it falls flat in every way possible. The movie is tonally all over the place, as it can't decide if it's a psychological thriller about Mike's need for answers about his missing brother, or a hokey fun horror flick. The latter would have been the correct choice to make, but it just meanders through the near two-hour runtime, until it decides it needs to wrap things up without any logical setup. The Five Nights at Freddy's game series is genuinely scary, but the movie version lacks any genuine scares, and doesn't even feature the animatronics as much as you'd like. Josh Hutcherson does his best but doesn't possess leading man qualities and most of the support cast are weak, with a subplot featuring a potential family court battle for custody of Mike's little sister failing to ignite any interest or relevance. The highlight of the movie is Matthew Lillard as Mike's job advisor, Steve Raglan. Lillard is perfect for this kind of role, with his quirky mannerisms and creepy demeanor, but one man can't save this movie, and Five Nights at Freddy's is best left closed for business.